let us confess our faith using the words of the Apostles' Creed. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, God's only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day, he rose again. He ascended to heaven. He is seated at the right hand of the Father, and he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Guided by Christ, made known to the nations, let us offer our prayers for the church, the world, and all people in need. For the gospel proclaimed in word and deed, for communities of faith far and near, and for all who show the face of Christ throughout the world, let us pray. In you, we live and move and have our being. Grant our parish servants united grace to find our life refreshed in you. Accompany us as we live out your mission and ministry in our context. Give us rest and renewal and strengthen us for mission in your name. Let us pray. For creation, sun, moon, and stars, life forming in the dark earth and ocean deep, mountains, clouds, and ocean and storms, and creatures seen and unseen, and for the Holy Spirit's guidance in our stewardship of God's creation, let us pray. For those responsible for safety and protection, for emergency responders, security guards, attorneys and advocates, civil servants and leaders of governments, that they witness the mercy to mercy and justice throughout the world. Let us pray. For those who suffer this day, especially those we name out loud at this time, That Christ, our healer, transform sickness into health, loneliness into companionship, bereavement into consolation, and suffering into peace. Let us pray. For our companions on life's journey in this worshiping community, for loved ones who cannot be with us this day, and for guidance during struggles we face that God's glory is revealed around and among us. Let us pray. In thanksgiving for the faithful departed who now rest from their earthly pilgrimage, that their lives of service and prayer inspire us in our living, let us pray. Merciful God, hear the prayers of your people, spoken or silent, for the sake of the one who dwells among us, your Son, Jesus Christ, our Savior. Amen. Friends, we give to God out of the generosity that God has given to us. During this next time, please take this opportunity to write a check and send it to the congregation of your choice. Then the addresses will be on your screen. Even though some of us are not gathering in person and some of us are, ministry is still happening.
Let us pray. Oh God, receive these gifts as you receive us. Like a mother receives her child with arms open wide. Nourish us anew in your tender care and empower us in faithful service to tend to others with the same love through Jesus Christ, our saving grace. Amen. We're gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Let us pray the prayer Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. God, the creator, strengthen you. Jesus, the beloved, fill you. And the Holy Spirit, the comforter, keep you in peace. Amen. Let us go out and singing our sending hymn, Shine, Jesus, Shine.